KK is with me. KK, as the man heading up the uh, communications at Cricket South Africa, you've been carrying this baby with us. Yes, sir. Like, so let's just do that. Let's just reveal. Let's just show South Africa what the Mzansi Super League trophy is going to look like. Uh, it's the first time ever seen on television. And there, there it is. Go. Here you go. So is there a story? What happened? Design? Yeah. You know? There's a very interesting story. Um, so, you know, there's a international and a South African flavor put into this trophy, as you can see. Uh -huh. uh, we had uh, the great guys from, uh, from the studios in the UK, from Thomas Light, and also our very own Latu Mangokolo, who made sure that, you know, the trophy that you see right here in front of you has got that international flavor, but also that South African and African appeal uh -huh. that we're trying to reach. As you know, uh, with the Mzanzi Super League, what we're trying to do is that bring that excitement back. We're very tired of just sitting on the sidelines of watching other sporting codes. But with this, Mzanzi Super League is a great opportunity for us just to bring that excitement back into cricket. Cricket T20, and it's live on the SABC. We are the exclusive uh, broadcast partner for the uh, Mzansi Super League T20. What players can I be excited about? Who are uh, the big names that are going to blow our minds when it comes up on SABC3? Well, I can get you excited already with the likes of Chris Gale. You know, to, the um, Gale Force. Exactly, and I mean our very own Kahiso Rabada, who's going to be with the Jersey Stars. Mm -hmm. You also have Mr. 360 himself, A.B. De Villiers. But also joining Chris Gale from the Caribbean, you've got also Dwayne Bravo, who's very excited and made his uh, excitement very clear earlier this week on social media. Uh -huh. And those are the f uh, few names, just to mention, but also some of the y exciting youngsters that we have right here at our shores. It starts on the 16th of November. They're playing for this trophy. I know, I know I mentioned the number, but I think we need to repeat that to South Africans because as much as they're playing for this beautiful new trophy, yeah. they're also playing for huge prize money. Yeah, it's a huge prize money. I mean, the, the pool in its entirety, we're looking at 10 million rands with the winners taking away 7 million. This is like... So, <laughs> <laughs> but Thomas, I mean, we, like I said, we've really made our intentions clear as Cricket South Africa and with the Mzansi Super League. You know, this is our time right now just to bring the sports to the fore, to the greater South African public. And what better way to bring it to SABC? It can't be better than that. Cricket. Are you a cricket fan at least, Mona? Absolutely not. <laughs> we can change that. that but we are here. <laughs> to... I'm a Kesa Chiefs fan. Well, we can and change that. And that is just too much heart. It's too much heart attack and trauma for me to now look at other sports. It's enough. They've they've made me struggle. Can I give you the Can enough. I give you the Toronto Raptors as well? Just I to say. I actually don't have the emotional capacity to support any other sport right now. You just you're done. <laughs> I am. You're I'm there. in an abusive relationship. Banyana, banyana, you have to. Chiefs. You can't leave banyana. Uh, of course, of course. Thank you. Banana, Thank banana. you. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> there you go. Yeah. And we will make you a Raptors fan before the end of the night. But let's bring him out. South Africa's one and only sports comedian. He's been doing it for five years, live right here on SABC One. He is the heavyweight of humor. He's undefeated. He brings the uppercuts. He brings the jabs. He makes sure that we ridicule and joke about those who do it wrong in sport in the week that was. He is. The shampoo nizer, <laughs> shampoo nino. Shout out, shout out, man. Ah, Emmanuel. Uh, happy birthday to my sister Dineo and uh, my nephew Lekanolo at home. Okay, that's my friend. Really happy birthday. It's, no, I, it's I, not supposed to be funny. funny. I need to greet. I need to observe protocol. Okay. Yeah, Masai, welcome to South Africa. Yeah, I'm. I'm glad you are here to tell Thomas in person that his dream of being a basketball player will never happen. <laughs> <laughs> it will never happen. This guy is the same, same, same height as LeBron, LeBron James shoe. <laughs> like every day, Thomas is like, yo, LeBron long distance relationship mm. it will never mm. happen uh banana banana mm. how are you guys mm. you guys you guys are bafana bafana's career goals <laughs> like mm. bafana bafana is looking at you like yo it's like a rasta coming into fruit and veg it's like yo <laughs> that's how bafana bafana sees you like oh wow pineapple so fresh <laughs> that's, 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 that's how a rasta feels and bafana bafana is like yo oh, and <laughs> you guys should tell them <laughs> this could have been you but you're busy being beaten by muratini we don't know you know muratini is so scarce no one knows about Muratini. If you type Muratini on a GPS, it's like, why? 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 Hurrah, hurrah, Thomas. Uh, Thomas, I'm coming straight. Uh, uh, I've done the, the, the Soweto Marathon, finally. 
Oh, really? Yes, yes, yes. yes. All Finally. 42 kilometers. All 42, yeah. Mm -hmm. I watched it and I spoke about <laughs> it and I wrote on Twitter. I did everything, everything that was necessary for Soweto Marathon. I've done it so and everything. Here. Yeah, no, now I'll tell you, Thomas, I give a little bit what's on Soweto Marathon. Because mm -hmm. you know when you are, oh, go Soweto Marathon, dude, when it's so, you are desperate. 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 You I'm so disappointed. The first South African to cross the line, K number five. Guys, how is this over to Kant? <laughs> like, I mean, you don't know. Angere is there. So he was like, why didn't you guys ask for assistance? Because those people are foreigners and tourists. We could have helped you, Joe. All we have to do, half it, not. Vimba! This guy is Joe. Ah, guys, you've been bit, yo, yo, bit, you know, all these people and are smart. They come here as tourists. Come to, mm -mm, they are scouting the way today. Now they are taking our trophies. Thomas, I'm coming straight out of rehab. Uh, South Africa, I was in rehab for the past, last week. Yeah, and uh, I'm, I'm better now because I was there being cancelled to stop joking about Kaiser Chiefs. It's hard to, to oh, stop geez. joking about Kaiser <laughs> Chiefs. Like, sometimes it's hard. I, I stopped. I was winning until Katsande decided to tackle a penalty. Like, where's the record tackle from behind? Where's the come out? I think he should have got a red card. Get dogs so dead again. He scored today. Yeah, my penalty. <laughs> well, I tell him, penalty. Get dogs so. Why the dogs so? Denying yourself and own <laughs> obvious goal scoring opportunity. <laughs> ah, get dogs so. No Chiefs win. We win like a goal we won. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I know at least one, one, How's that one. Just, just, I guess you're like, I like one, just one, one. one. But let's not get deep into it. Uh, as you can see, Thomas Kittilega back, he so, yeah, he so, he excuse the sundowns. Banali excuse you, they are all in this bag. And the excuse the sundowns has nothing to do with football. Mm. Why did you get knocked out of the Telcom Cup? Yeah, no, we miss Mandela. <laughs> Yeah, we miss Mandela. Christmas Asian is around race. the corner. Tom, like Sundowns is get, it's pulling out of every trough, every cup, except the Sporters 10 cupcake. Like, that's the only cup. Elena Lefoy Kriang, yo, Sundowns, man. Why are you pop? So I'm talking Telcom, Telcom, no, never left so pop, Sundowns. Like, on paper, you are the best. When it's an Agamutikamu fielding, Kiona team. Like, Laramaga, I can sort of let the Galavia, like, they are going to kick you, Naman Kion. I can sort like expensive players, Marba Dalapap. You want to, you want us to debate about it. But they're yeah. expensive, Marba Dala not. It's like uh, buying a Gucci belt and one more from a gym. Mm. Yeah, yeah it's, that's why I guess I'm moving chance. We lose it. I'm mm. a Telcom Cup. Telcom Cup. 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 Ah, it's a lot of three ones. It's what the team is a confident. Orlando Pirates. Confidence That's the Orlando Paris confidence. Mama Joy, oh, correct. Hello, Mama Joy. Oh, Mama Joy, wale baga bag. So I took pizza fella. My parents, let's discuss this thing. Who is the real coach? โอ้บ่าวบ่นี่มารบาร์กิมารูลานิลิมิชบันซิกวาลโกโคโนกาดิพาวเรนเจอร์ซะเฮ้ยเฮ้ยบ่าวบ่นี่มาเอฟเฟ
Josie Stars, that's Jersey. my team. Josie Stars is that's your team. Because I'm from Gale Josie, Force. I can't be every year. I can't. And I'm oh. with Chris Gale, man. Exactly. Ah, and Kakisora about that too. Ah, then I'm gone. Okay, safe. <laughs>